What's going on guys, Zach here with Rigid Inspections. Um, got a deck here. It's kind of disguised as a good deck. It looks like they got some new composite on it, but uh, you can see right away an issue here. The support is uh, kind of starting to bow a little bit. Uh, terrible gutter termination points here. I mean, it's going underground, but you never know when these things can clog up and start leaking and it's gonna be right next to the post. The post is in soil, it's starting to rot. You can kind of see a little at the bottom there. But uh, it's also just a four by six. Um, I like to see six by six here. You can see it's bowing this way as well. Um, and you can tell too, originally this was built um, about, looks like maybe 20 inches on center. Because you can see every other joist has a smaller hanger and then they added these here with the larger hangers at some point after the after the fact but uh this is all supporting a roof load so that's another reason why this is just too small of a support because it's not only supporting the deck but a roof as well um stair stringers they got them in nailed to a drop header no uh hangers or strapping i don't like like the way that that's attached there I'm not a fan of that attachment that way um, you can see the new composite new aluminum railing but we go back here and i'm sure you guys can see it look how much it drops where those stairs are connected it's sagging big time right here and uh if we come up closer here So obviously you got this outer beam attached, resting on the support, but if you look, only one of the joists of the beam are sitting on the support. The other one's just hanging off completely. And we go down here, same thing. If you look, this outer joist isn't even sitting on anything. It's literally just floating in the air see that there so some major structural issues here obviously um, the decks just not built to even support itself let alone a set of stairs and a roof above it so this thing is definitely gonna need some work 